All right, guys, so this is my work area for this one. These are all the tools I'm gonna be using today. I'm gonna be making a black rum cake for you guys. So I just wanna feature off some main ingredients. This is some raisins that have been soaking in red label wine and white oak rum. All right, so we're gonna start. Let's dive into it, guys. All right, you're gonna start by sifting the flour. real quick as always guys you know when you do this you refine your flour remove all the when you go to sift the flour guys you could literally just shake it until everything goes out all right but we're just breaking up anything that's combined you know sometimes your flour get lumps all right I don't like telling you guys to do stuff. I like to explain the whys behind why you do stuff. All right. Next, we're gonna go ahead and add is our baking powder. We're gonna add our nutmeg. This is fresh nutmeg, guys. So if you could tell, I'm adding all the dry stuff first. Some cinnamon. Powder, then some ground allspice, I'm going to go ahead and add a pinch of salt, all right, all right, we're just going to go ahead and fold it in. Starting to smell like Christmas already, guys. I already got my Christmas tree up. Got my gifts on the room. All right. Now we're gonna go ahead and combine some of the wet stuff. All right. Now that all that is removed, go ahead and just combine these. and everything is going to be in the description so don't worry about the exact measurements right now I'm adding some almond extract so this is all the liquid stuff I'm going to go ahead and add some white rum this is the oh yeah also going to go ahead and add some red label wine one is going to be good guys add my brown brown sugar I'm using refined brown sugar guys Adding some butter, soft room temperature butter. All right, we're gonna go ahead and add some browning. All right, now we're gonna go ahead and plug our mixer in. It's mixing time. We're gonna start off and low. Right, so now we're gonna get back our dry ingredient. All of our dry stuff. Stuff from the bottom. Now let's 
sugar, and all the egg. All right, I'm just gonna start fold everything together. because you don't want it to be too much. And the more you mix, you're gonna get everything together. There's more brown inside at the bottom, there's more flour at the bottom. So you're just gonna keep mixing. mix by hand so now we're gonna go and get the mixer all right so I have two baking tin all right so grab your baking tin and I'm gonna about grease with some butter all right we're gonna transfer a little batter So I'm gonna stick these in the oven at 300. Well, no, I'm not quite at 300, I'm at 275. So I'm at 275, and this is gonna take like an hour and a half, hour 45. See you guys then. All right, guys, so halfway through, I'm gonna just give you guys a glance of what's going on inside here. Okay, almost there, guys. All right, guys, there we are, and we are ready. So I'm gonna pull these out, let them cool, and we're gonna come back. All right, guys, beautiful, nice Christmas cake, rum cake. I'm gonna let these cool, I'm gonna cut these, and enjoy. What I like to do, guys, is to take a little red label and pour it all over it, let it soak in it. Just let them cool. 